everyone, I'm really excited about today's video because it's um, something that I've been waiting a long time for and it's a brand new line from Lush. Um, I've got one of the fragrances here and um, I should say that this is um, actually was originally a shower gel that came out last year for the Lush um, Christmas collection called Ponche and it was in quite a few of the Christmas gift sets and I received this in um, one of my Christmas gift sets that I got last year and um, it's called Ponche and um, this year they released a fragrance version of it and um, there's a new line of Christmas fragrances this year including um, some of their best-selling um, shower gel products so there's um, among them is um, Snow Fairy which is one of the most popular Christmas um, lush shower gel fragrances and there's also um, Snow Cake which is a, um, an almond uh, fragrance soap that they sometimes bring out for Christmas. I've not seen it this year so I'm not sure if they've actually brought it out again this year or if it's just the fragrance but anyway um, this one is Ponche that I've got to show you today and it is brand new because um, you know they've only had the shower gel before they've got the shower gel again this year and um, now they've got the fragrance so it is only a year old scent, scent I guess and and um, this is what it looks like. The packaging is very plain, it just says Lush Scent Ponche and the back you have just the ingredients and it's just a regular top and it is a sprayer, not a dab one like the um, the last line, the 2013 Gorilla Fragrance line have kind of no spray, you have to dab it on, this one has a sprayer. And um, these are all only available in 30 millilitres and so this is what the 30 ml looks like and unfortunately because it is a new fragrance there's not, no, not really much information on the internet about it yet and um, for Grantica don't have it on unlike the, the Gorilla fragrance line which for Grantica do have um, so um, I don't actually know the exact notes but I'll just give you a brief description on here and it says tropical fruits and tequila the perfect fragrance for a fiesta and when I um, got the shower gel last year, I loved the fragrance of it so much. I was just thinking, I wish they brought this out in a perfume. It'd just be the best um, lush perfume ever. And so this year, I'm just so happy. And um, these only came out last week, and they're, um, as far as I'm aware, only available online. So if you go onto lush.co.uk, um, you should be able to, to um, buy them. But I would be quite fast about it because they are limited edition, so I'm guessing that they will go quite fast. Um, so yeah, I'll just spray this again. I've had it on all day, but I'll just spray it again so I get the top notes. Um, ooh, okay, so it's a very strong, energetic fragrance. Um, it is very reminiscent of like um, other fruity fragrances that are very electric, electrifying, kind of you know pulsating. Um, Beyonce's Ports is the one that this immediately reminds me of and it's not because it necessarily smells you know very alike to that fragrance it doesn't but it's got that same kind of a very energetic party boozy kind of quality to it so it does start off very fruity um, it's tro it is tropical fruits but I wouldn't say it's overly kind of pineapple or passion fruity it's just a really nice blend of them and it does definitely smell like fruit punch, um, alcoholic fruit punch, and um, there's tequila um, in this, I don't know if there's actual tequila in the end, uh, it doesn't, I mean it just says alcohol, it doesn't say that um, there's actual tequila in this, so I'm guessing it's just the kind of artificial tequila in it, but it just, just give, does give a really alcoholic vibe, it's like a, um, you know, tropical alcoholic fragrance um, like you would make if you made homemade punch um, for example I can imagine it would smell like that or also you know kind of the Caribbean twist uh, mixed cocktails you get from the supermarket it is a little bit reminiscent of them um, but it's it's just so um, just so beautiful um, it's not a complex fragrance it's not like the um, Gorilla fragrance line where the you know these big concept perfumes it's nothing like that it's just um, quite a simple fragrance it does stay quite linear throughout 
There is a kind of um, gummy kind of note to it, as if there's like almost um, nectar a nectar or nectarine um, note to this. It's kind of bubble gummy, like um, it does have an element of snow fairy to it. Um, that kind of bubble gum, pink bubble gum kind of element to to it. Um, sorry, but um, you know, overall, I wouldn't say that it is a um, overly gourmand um, if, if only kind of in an alcoholic you can imagine drinking this but not eating it and it does work very well as a perfume I was a bit worried about how the um, fragrance from the shower gel would translate into perfume form but it is just very um, a very good transition um, I would say that this is a little bit more fruity than the shower gel the shower gel was um, a little bit more toned down whereas this one is a lot more loud but overall it is a very good um, transition and um, as you can see I've only had this for a few days and I've already used quite a bit of it so um, I think that this one is definitely one that hopefully I should be able to repurchase um, that's why I'm hoping that it doesn't run out too soon because I want all you guys to try out the line and also because I want to repurchase it for future um, use um, it does have a use by date on it but um, it's 2017 um, so you know you, you will probably use it within that date but also if you keep this in a, a cold dark place it should last fine and um, I won't be too worried about that and um, so overall I really like this fragrance um, I think it's one of the best um, simple lush fragrances I think it's very different to the Gorilla fragrance line and um, I like those in a different kind of way because um, even though they're not necessarily straightforward, nice smelling fragrances, they are very a lot more interesting. Whereas this one is more um, just just smells nice. It's great for Christmas. It's great for parties. I just love it so much. There is a little bit of a powdery element to it. It does smell quite clean. So you can imagine, you know, it has that kind of almost shower gel element where it does smell clean as well. But overall it's just very fruity it's very long lasting as well it does last a good long time and um, i'd say about six seven eight hours so um you know that's good by the end you just kind of get a brief dry down of um fruits it's not as strong anymore and that bubble gum element kind of fades away um so yeah i don't really have too much to say about this um i'm quite disappointed that the packaging is so plain and um, i think that they could have had a picture on like with the Gorilla Fragrance line but as it's a limited edition I can't really complain um, I would also like to try the Snow Fairy fragrance and also um, the Snow Cake one they've also got Rose Jam which I'm not too fussed about um, I've tried I think I've tried a Rose Jam Lush product the um, Shower Gel maybe and it was nice but it's not really something I'm you know desperate to have so I would definitely recommend this fragrance and I would recommend that you buy it fast if you're going to buy it. Okay, thank you very much. I also have another Lush fragrance that I've bought this week and it is The Bug. So I will be reviewing that um, shortly, maybe even now, I'm not sure. Um, so check that video out as well. Thank you very much. Bye.